Come on, I just want to check out. Why? Because he told you to. Stop making this about him. Just talk to me. We raced in a lot of the same races growing up, and one of us would always have a better race than the other. So in the car, on the way home, one of us would be happy, and the other would be completely miserable. There was no middle ground. It was like it was impossible for us both to be happy at the same time. And it's kind of been the same ever since. Look, it's my job to talk to the drivers, Kelly. Yeah, and who gave you that job? Why are you being like this? It's not even me you're angry with. Maybe it is. Oh, really? This again? We were kids, Kelly. You left me behind. Oh, come on, what was I supposed to say? Oh, oh, thanks, Dad, for, for, for continuing to invest in my career, but I'm afraid I'm going to have to decline, just in case I hurt poor Kelly's feet. Of course not. And what? It didn't have to be a choice, Dev. He had the money to fund both of our careers. I just... I wanted you to... fight for me. He never listened to me. He always listened to you. Well, we were young. Yeah. But we're adults now. Yeah. Well, if it's any consolation, I'm not much competition anymore. <laughs> you never were. I'm sorry, Kelly. For everything. You were always faster than me. <laughs> There, I said it. Nice try. I mean it. And did you mean it? <laughs> of course not. Faster than me. No, 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 no. She was never faster than me. She'd love that. No. But if there's one thing my old man taught me, it's that sometimes people need to hear what they need to hear. You know? Hey, Mom. Cal, I'm reading more and more about these funding issues. Only an issue if we don't get fifth, apparently. What do you make of it all? Well, he won't. He won't really do it, surely. I mean, it's only been two seasons, for goodness sake. And Connor Sports certainly isn't the worst team on the grid. You have a real way with words, Mom. <laughs> What's your father have to say for himself? I have no idea. You've still not spoken to him? I'm sure you can relate. Yes, but I mean, I don't have to work with the man. Look, you don't have to like him. You only have to talk to him. <sighs> you sound like Devon. Oh, maybe Devon has a point. Yeah, yeah, okay. Thanks, Mum. I'm going now. Lots of love. Bye. Absolutely. Why are you doing this? I saw him in the paddock. This would have been Sao Paulo. And I, um, yeah, I finally spoke to him. I just wanted to know why. There's something's come up, I'll uh, call you back. Kelly, so I'm uh, allowed to talk to you now. Why are you doing this? Doing what? Why are you being so hard line about this? For this to be a worthwhile investment, Connor Sport Racing must be successful. It's just business. It's not, though, is it? Excuse me? Well, why am I in the team if it's just business? Why was Devon? You can't keep involving your family in this and then hiding behind it's just business. This is one of the biggest investments I have ever made. I must take care of the business. Come on. Who do you think will uh, inherit it after I'm gone? Well, Devon, obviously. I'm, I'm not interested in any of it. These uh, matters are complex. But they all benefit 
the business. They all benefit the family. And ultimately, they all benefit you. You said this the last time you tried to stop me racing. I didn't buy it at 12, and I certainly don't buy it now. I don't understand what goes on in that head of yours. You threatened to end my F1 career, and then you claim it's for my benefit. Have you any idea how much money I have ploughed into the team? <sighs> yeah, that's the thing with you. Money. Nothing changes. I wouldn't expect you to understand. No, Dad. I wouldn't expect you to. You need to be more realistic, that's all. Not everyone survives in F1. You know that. Fifth in the standings. Fifth? Fifth. Safety car's in this lap. Repeat, the safety car is in this lap. That means it's our chance to shine. Come on, you can do this. Let's go. No, no pressure then. Green flag. Battery charge is high, let's use that overtake button a bit more. Brilliant manoeuvre, two places at once.
DRS has been enabled. DRS is now enabled. OK, that's us with five laps of fuel remaining, five laps of fuel left. Great manoeuvre, you made it look so easy.
Okay, we lost the position, try to keep focus. Final lap, final lap, push, push. Right, we've got enough fuel for three more laps. Well, what a fantastic race that was. Absolutely loved it. But Natalie, do you think we see Connor Sport next season? Rumours say maybe not. I hope so. I feel like they deserve it. They've been box office for me. They've taken chances. They've been bold in all their moves. And ultimately, that's great for us and for the fans. Absolutely. Couldn't agree more. But there's not much of the season left. And they'll be hoping they can carry this form into the final stages. Time will tell. Well, what a thrilling end to an incredible Grand Prix weekend. Our top three finishers should be incredibly happy with what they were able to achieve out there today. Wow, Callie, a really strong performance out there today. Just tell me, though, how big a role did the safety car play? Yeah, I mean, I really fancied my chances after the safety car. Obviously, it's going to really disrupt the race, but I was able to take advantage of it today. Um, I saw an opportunity and I went for it, and it worked out well. Callie, your first F1 season is nearing an end. It must feel like a long road, but clearly you've put a lot into it. And is there anyone else that's been particularly influential this season? Influential? Um, well, yeah, I'd say my father has been influential, just not necessarily in the best way. I don't mind him funding the team, but I do mind when he starts trying to run it. And tell me, I'm not sure I could do it, but how has it been working so very closely with your family? Yeah. It's been a challenge. Um, let's just say we've all got our own opinions. Uh, family is never straightforward, and that's especially true of mine. There are rumors circulating that Connor Sport may not be around next season. Can you comment? Um, that sounds like a question for our investors. Um, I'm sure we'd all appreciate a public statement on the matter. 
Thank you so much for your time. Okay, so we are running two quite different setups out there today. And you don't need me to tell you how it... You don't need me to tell you how it... Davidoff, that's enough. I'm sorry? Get out. What on earth are you talking about? I've had an entire season of you whispering in people's ears. I'm asking you to leave the meeting. You can't be serious. This is not your team. And after today, it might not even exist. So get out and let those of us who actually care about the result do our jobs. We'll talk about this later, Ackerman. You can threaten me after the race. So be it. You coming, Devon? Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking I might actually stay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna stay. Well, that's up to you. Okay, hey, listen. You all know what's at stake. If we race as individuals today, the team dies. The only way we can survive this, the only way that any of us are coming back next season, is together. We all understand this? No, no. Aiden, Callie, look at me. You look at me. We understand this, yes? If you put yourself ahead of the team today, there's no more team. Callie. We got this. Yeah. And, um... I'm sorry if I was ever... Wow. What? Are you apologizing? Yeah. <laughs> I will forgive you on one condition. What's that? You get your share of the points. All right. Deal. <laughs> Chin up. Hey, did you find him? I didn't look too hard, to be honest. <laughs> Does Davidoff ever sulk? Hard to imagine. Listen, I hope I haven't caused you problems. I snapped it. It was unprofessional. Ooh, not at all, Casper. It was a delight to watch. You think it'll affect his decision? I've given up speculating, Cass. At this stage, nothing would surprise me. Yeah, well, we better get that result then. I guess we better add. And good luck today, Casper. Whatever happens, I'm so grateful for all you've done. Look, it's... it's been my pleasure. Connor Sport deserves to succeed. If the fates are kind, Casper. If the fates are kind. <laughs> I'm trackside. I'll see you there. Yeah, cool. I'll be a few minutes. <laughs> 